Red Reddit reaction. Uh, combining both of my channels here for uh, a death battle. It's time to get ready for death battle. And you're probably wondering what am I talking about because we are streaming actually right here on Twitch right now. Uh, focus, focus, focus on me. And you're probably wondering why we're doing this because um, I've been trying to figure out how I want to attempt uh, to uh, not necessarily rebrand the channel, but kind of restructure things as we, as you know, we just hit 200,000 subscribers. And a lot of that is in the part to the fact that, um, well, one of the reasons it took so long is because um, I kind of just do a little bit of everything, a little spastic. So it was very hard to like gain people to get. And then <laughs> most of the stuff I do reactions to, I generally don't, I have kind of the, uh, opposite opinion. I, I guess the not popular, the unpopular opinion of certain things. So that and being so kind of spastic on the channel, I, I kind of decided that I wanted to start splitting some of these things up. So for death battle, I figured it out. I figured it out. What we're going to do is for the main channel here, uh, Comics Plus, specifically for death battle related, like, you know, I love Avatar, and I, of course I love Boku no Hero Academia, My Hero Academia. Um, uh, what I'm going to do is uh, I'll go ahead and put the fight only on this channel, and then if you really, really, really want to see the full 18 minutes of me sitting and talking with the fandom and things like that... Uh, uh, yeah, check it out on the Red Reddit Reaction channel. That would be the best way to have it going, okay? Makes sense? Let's go ahead and get into it. This is your reaction to uh, Death Battle! <laughs> it makes it better, like an ice cold, delicious Miller Lite. Cheers to so far, safe, without research, great beer. Uh, by Miller far, Todoroki. Todoroki is built for this carbs. shit. He's about this life. Zuko, summer, I don't know about that. He ain't built for this. Now, if you were to throw in Azula. Miller Brewing Company, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. 96 calories and 3.2 carbs for 12 ounces. That is true. You could check out the broadcast on Twitch as well. And subscribe to my Twitch. Please, follow. I mean, follow for subscribe if you want. Let's go. All those cool anime heroes out there, there's bound to be plenty with angsty daddy issues. You mean like you? <laughs> Everybody in the chat <laughs> right now. Everybody in the chat, <laughs> what are you? Character. Wait, maybe some of you guys Let already watched this, so don't. The don't. Hunter of the if Avatar, you haven't watched it, who do you think is going to win? And Shoto Todoroki, Shoto. the prodigal son of fire and ice from My Hero Academia. Yes. He's whiz and I'm boobs. Yes. And it's our job to analyze their weapons, armor, and skills to find out who would win. A death battle. Todoroki is dope, Water, man. Earth, fire, air. The four elemental nations once coexisted peacefully. Then everything changed when, when the, the Fire Nation, Nation attacked. attacked. Yeah, the cranky old Fire Lord went and conquered basically the whole world. And a hundred years later, the equally powerful Master of Fire, Ozai, Ozai, continued that tyranny. Many believed his rule would one day pass to either his daughter, Azula, yep. or his son, Zuko. Right. Yeah, Fire Such Dad a good story. was way too ego-crazy for that. He yep. drove Azula mad. He <laughs> clearly favor her. Poor little Zuko got screwed over from the beginning. Can you imagine your dad saying that while your sister was born lucky, you, you were, were lucky, to, lucky be to be born? Yeah. I can't imagine my dad saying anything to me. Oh, right. Uh, well, despite this, Zuko was desperate to prove himself. What a fine work ethic. But he screwed up by talking out a turn in a big boy meeting. Mm -hmm. So naturally, his dad took him aside, sat him down, and taught him the importance of respecting others. Oh, wait, just kidding. Mm -hmm. He burned his friggin' face off. Holy shit! With his new scar came a new mission. Zuko would hunt down the elusive Avatar, the one threat to his nation's rule, to prove himself to his father and regain his honor. Which is just a nice way of saying he was banished so he could never come back. Yep. Just like my dad didn't. Though, frankly, Zuko did have the talent and training he needed to capture that someone. That was such a, That was better than the, the main Avatar. fight. Damn right! He's a fighting pro! The yeah, Avatar is great, man. You gotta check metal it out. Chains with a kick. He's super skilled with martial arts. I wish Firecom would stop oh yeah, blocking bender. all my reactions As like they just did. Zuko recently. harnesses the light of the sun. To I gotta recut him or something. Air. 
Wherever fire remains alight in an area that's not too cold, he can manipulate or bend it to his will. I mean, if I had to pick between swirling water around, tossed a few rocks, or farting hot air all the time, <laughs> I would definitely go with firebending. True that. It literally means you're a living flamethrower. Plus, yeah. it's surprisingly versatile. Aside from simply creating, launching, and moving flames, firebending can be used to heat objects, melt through ice prisons, and even defy gravity. Is that guy flying with fire? Awesome. Yeah. How does that even work? I don't know. I think I would try to be a waterbender. Waterbender by creating a rapid series of with explosions an inch or so away from the fire ball, the air bending the principles and fire is launched toward the user thereby creating propulsion yeah fire bending isn't just about creating fire it's about creating a bunch of it so zuko can make large long lasting walls of flame to protect himself Did you get that blood bending at a oh distance. my god that stuff's hot you know uh yeah it's fire you know, I've actually rigged up my arm. Yeah, to the reactions are on of fire bending. Uh, Dummy, Patreon. If you, you can check them out. Oh, the whole Health series thrilling. and now, Legend of Korra. This isn't as simple as just pointing and shooting. Firebenders fuel their nice flames plug. Thank with you. their own breath. And using it at all requires a fierce understanding of martial arts. Damn. What are you trying to do, the Macarena? Zuko's favorite form, the dancing dragon, uh, draws primarily from northern Shaolin Kung Fu. Mm. That's a Chinese martial art that's all about agility, wide stances, and aggressive attacks. Right. A perfect mix of speed and strength. Hmm. Like this. Whoa! Zuko can fight, though. Wiz, <coughs> why? Ha, ha, ha. That is true. Zuko can fight. Anyway, the fire that bends and he's like been, Zuko can generate he's, is extremely he hot. He fights capable of melting through a cast dudes all the door. time. This would need to be over 1,200 like water degrees people. Celsius. And while Sozin's comet was boosting his powers, Zuko's uncle Iro blasted apart the giant outer wall of Ba Sing Se. There is no war in Ba Sing Se. <laughs> until Iroh there comes There is no knock coronavirus it. I mean, in the U.S. That's like the thickest wall I've ever seen. Second only to the emotional walls between me and my dad. Even without <laughs> Sozin's comet, which only appears once every 100 years, mm. Zuko has more than enough firepower to level a building. That's no laughing matter for any person or building. He's even True quick that. enough to catch lightning, lightning and yeah. use his fire power. Yo, that was the best fucking moment of Kapow! all time. Suck yeah. It, dad. Oh, shoot. Wait, did that was the best moment lightning? in the fucking Zuko's quest for the Avatar series. led him down a different path than he expected. Inspired by his kind uncle and the Avatar himself, he joined the heroes on a new journey, one of self-discovery. Yeah, it turns out he didn't need his dad's approval after all. He just needed to approve himself. Now that's character development. Zuko's definitely had a heated redemption arc. And now that he's the fire daddy, uh, <laughs> Lord, fire Lord, his honor keeps burning brighter. Are you crushing on Zuko? What? No, no. <laughs> yeah, you, uh, it's okay, Wiz. Everybody does. <laughs> Hello, Zuko here. <laughs> I, you know, I have never seen the movie, actually, the live action. Welcome to a world where the supernatural What's up? is natural. What's up? Where more than 80% of the population possesses superhuman abilities known as quirks. And because there everyone you. loves to game a system, there's a superhero leaderboard. At the very top of it stands the ultimate hero. Ha 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 ha! And reputation were Good job, young Midoriya. A symbol of peace for everyone. That is, everyone except the hero perpetually stuck at rank number two. two yep. That's Endeavor, and he vowed to surpass What's up? All Might. But 24. his literal firepower Fire. was nice just timing. never enough. But if he couldn't do it himself, he would vicariously through his own heir. True Thus, that. he made the desperate decision yep. to arrange a quirk marriage. Yeah. Basically, he Fucking paid like a family off to get a wife with an ice quirk and popped out kids until he got the right quirk right. combo. Gross. I feel like I need a shower. After four, uh, attempts, they finally spawned the child he was looking for, Shoto Todoroki. Half cold, half Great hot. fucking story, right but he kind of got ruined and left after the second like season. Endeavor quickly separated they haven't really done shit with him. supposedly lesser siblings, ruthlessly training him to become the most powerful what hero What up, no history. luck? Surprise, Welcome to the party. Things didn't go so well. He drove Shoto's mom totally insane until she yep. broke. Fire! Pouring boiling water on her son's left side mm. because it reminded her too much of him. Mm. Mm. Okay, this is getting super heavy for a colorful cartoon about superpowers and frog this people. Shit was great, Fortunately, man. Todoroki never truly fell for his father's disgusting manipulation. He attended UA High yep. School, a hero academy, and worked to use his power for good. But just his mom's power. For Why good. Fire when you can stick it to the man. 
The man being a big scary fire dad over there. Anyone else notice his facial hair is made of fire? How's that work? <laughs> From his right side, Todoroki can summon intense mm. bouts of cold, freezing the air, or even creating massive And so far, he hasn't been Talk able to manipulate cold. This and like a so good edgy teen, Shoto named this super iceberg something badass. Heaven piercing ice wall. <laughs> Yo, oh, I lost my shit when he did this. He can create sheets of ice this was like the peak of my hero academia. A Healy. While he can't manipulate the ice after he's launched it, he has extremely precise control over its initial release. He can even freeze opponents so thoroughly <laughs> that they are frozen both inside and out, effortlessly yep. causing necrosis and shattering body parts. Yep. Seriously, that's so dark. It's chilling. Talk about having a cold shoulder. But Todoroki has a problem. While yeah. he is highly resistant to cold, he's not immune. Right. Here I am. Guess I'll die. Oh, I won't be needing you this time, dummy. Genuine joy. Casting too much ice from his right side will cause his body temperature to drop until he falls unconscious, potentially even suffering frostbite. I mean, it takes freezing an entire building before side effects even start to show up. So it's not us. Why'd you even make the stupid robot? That's why Endeavor chose to mix ice with fire. See, he had the same problem with his own fire quirk. Exhaustion, yeah. But with cold and hot combined, they could counter each other's weaknesses. Thankfully, Shoto made a friend who helped show him that his fire wasn't his father's. This was a great it was moment, his own. Man. My you favorite him, episode. Deku, finally, the full power of was Icy great. Hot was unleashed. Are you think you could help my back? Just this might be one of the greatest moments the in anime show. history. While honestly. he's much less proficient with fire, given his lack of experience with it, right. this half of his quirk is identical to Endeavor's. His fire is hot enough to melt Tetsu Tetsu, whose body can turn to steel, oh, which means shit. it can reach temperatures shit. over 1,600 degrees. He can blast fire like a raging inferno, form walls of flame to block off areas, and use his evil dead signature technique. Flash fire! <laughs> Flash fire is a method of compressing flame under super hot temperatures before releasing it in a single strike. Right. Endeavor can also shape his fire, use it to cling to walls, and fly. But even if he is a huge dick, Endeavor was kinda right. Fire and ice combined put both quirks at their best. Shoto's one of the best in his class, taking hits from a yep. tank like Deku, fighting top tier foes like Sane, and keeping up with classmates like Bakugo and Tokoyami. Who can block Kaminari's electricity? And while he's often criticized for relying too much on his quirk, Todoroki is incredibly smart and a quick thinker, right. reading and setting traps for his opponents in the blink of an eye. And after all that craziness, he finally patched things up with his mom. They and really gotta, yo, my hero need, my person. hero, they gotta, they what gotta bring story. it next season, dude, because that, that was like a waste of the last too. season. Not mama, though. The first half was all right, but the second perfect. half was well so on his way to becoming a successful dumb. hero. Shoto Todoroki no longer fights in spite of his father, mm. but for himself and the sake of others. I'm gonna say, I mean, I'm putting a. I'll be a hero. Yes. Ooh, English. All I mean, right, I'm still with Todoroki. The, the only thing I could imagine but is the fact that Zuko has Blue more Chew. control over fire, but I can't imagine that. No. Guys, remember when you were always ready to go? Even when you're stuck indoors for ages, we all know having a good time in bed makes life... Like... Oh, what, what is going on here? Um. Anyway, so, yeah. Let me turn it down a little bit. Well... What is Blue Chew? Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, pretty much like uh, like Todoroki, he's smarter. He's had more experience in fights. Um, he's got two different powers at their ma most powerful. He will just keep coming and coming. Whereas I've never seen Zuko really take people on on his own. Basically, you know, like now again, if it's Azula, it's a whole different thing. Because she's uh, quirky, uh, like, yeah, she's clever and shit. So yeah, I'm uh, I'm with uh, I'm with uh, Todoroki. Yeah, Zula. Let's go! Let's go. Oh, they did it this style, huh? Cute, cute. A villain? You'll pay for that. Mm. No way! I'm not the bad guy here. I mean, not anymore. 
Damn. Damn. Who's doing the voice? Like my father. I'll prove I'm better than both of you. What? They both got daddy issues. What's the matter? Melting under pressure? <laughs> He's just like me. Really? What? Yo, I ain't never seen Zuko pull off those many moves. Ah, my cabbages! No, my cabbages! <laughs> I never intended to finish you with fire. You could obviously block it. But not this. It's over. What? I mean, yeah, that's true. Wow, Zuko's gonna win? care how much power you have I know who I am I will win then I'll have to go beyond plus ultra there you go there you go it's over game over sorry Zuko What? Oh, that's dope. That is sick. That is sick. That's a nice callback. Both of them, actually. Whoa! <laughs> oh, shit. Apologies. Wow. Okay, that was epic. Please grieving here <laughs> both Todoroki and Zuko held solid advantages over the other Zuko's martial arts athleticism Whoa. and lightning fast reflexes meant that if he could get close to Todoroki yeah. he could likely end the fight pretty yeah. quick but Shoto's no slouch the guy may be better at long range but he's been in scraps before yep. like with the super fast yep. super deadly hero killer stain more and training that ice more experience up everywhere and his own super sliding and boosting skills Shoto made it hard for Zuko to get close for long yeah. plus the speed difference wasn't all that drastic Todoroki's fellow student Tokoyami's dark shadow blocked Kaminari's electricity after it had been fired Quirks are not magic, and there are very few ways for electricity to travel through the air. Lightning is essentially an ionized path that electricity travels through. Kaminari's quirk must use the same method. Dark Shadow blocked Kaminari, Bakugo dodged Dark Shadow, and Todoroki can match Bakugo in a fight. Bada bing bada boom, that's lightning fast reflexes, baby. <laughs> While Zuko certainly had more control over fire, right. Todoroki could easily repel his fire bending with his own flames. Good not point. to mention the clear difference in yep. temperature. Yep. Zuko may be skilled with fire, but he's not immune to it. Nor did he true, have any reliable that. counter for fast and massive ice attacks. Exactly. We don't even need to bust out the calculator for this one, Wiz. That stadium is circled by a four kilometer track. Fuck. That's huge. And the edgy ice wall covered almost half of it in less than a second. Zuko didn't have that kind of power spread. Yep. Yes, I know fire melts ice, but not but instantly not, not when that it comes quick. to yeah. gigantic exactly. glaciers. Yeah, Plus, this is sound. Fire becomes much more difficult in cold temperatures. Yep. Sure, Zuko's melted through ice prisons before, but only ones where he could still move or at least breathe. Right. Remember, firebending requires breath and movement. Right. When Azula was trapped in an ice prison so compact she couldn't, she couldn't move, move yeah. or breathe, she was helpless. <laughs> but like, that was Shoto could just freeze over Zuko's insides anyway. No way he was surviving that. Zuko might have been an admirable bender and adorable fan favorite, but Todoroki's ultimate <laughs> versatile defense and incredible yeah, power Yeah, you know there're going to be some mad fucking people Zuko right now. Zuko aimed for success, but his opponent Shoto put him on ice. Mm. The winner is Shoto Todoroki. Good call. Good call.
Good call. Thanks for watching this episode of Death Battle. Come back next week to see previews of our upcoming matchups. If you want to watch more stuff, you can click the boxes right around oh, here. Oh, shit. And you can always pick up some DV merch at store. Ah, Aang versus uh, Eric. Uh, Edward. Oh, the Flash versus who? Sonic. What the fuck? <laughs> next week? I guess we'll be back for that one. Oh, shit. I never even saw this one. Beerus. Oh, there's a lot going on. Yeah, that, I mean that that uh, that was that was it. That was that was a that was a given how they were going going that way. Like I love, I love Zuko, man. Zuko was still like for me the only really like good and like like really interesting story of uh, Avatar, the Avatar series outside of Korra. Uh, though, you know, Azula, all of that. Like, I did not like most of those kids. Aang, um, Zuko, he was all right, though. Um, though when the, um, when water build, and not to spoil things, so when water building starts to pick up later in the series, um, in the advancement of that, that started to get interesting a lot more for Katara, uh, Kotara, Katara, Katara, Kotara, whatever. But um yeah anyways um yeah it it was going uh, like just because I know that much about um I don't even know where my shirt is about Zuko uh, about Todoroki th that that just watch that fight Midoriya versus uh Todoroki <sighs> one of the best moments in animated history like one of the best moments of anime like I, I think that was My Hero Academia at its peak, honestly. The tournament angle was, like, at its best in terms of, like, building up a really good story and with multiple kids uh, together. Yes, season three of uh, My Hero Academia with All Might and then All for One, uh, that was, it was good. And it, it was definitely dramatic, but, man, that was just, like, a, it, it was a, that tournament angle was just a, such a good belt about I mean, Dragon Ball Super also brought us something as well, but even Dragon Ball Super wasn't at that same a, a time. Speaking of which, guys, I am watching right now The God of High School on Patreon. So if you're interested in that, I tried to show you guys a sample on YouTube within like four minutes or so. They took it down when I premiered it. So it is on Patreon as an exclusive. So if you're interested in seeing that, I am enjoying that anime right right now. It is amazing. So uh, please make sure you check that out on Patreon. Well, uh, yeah, man, that was a uh, that was very well done. Death Battle really thought that through, and I really like the homages they did as well to certain parts of the scenes. Um, the way they took out Zuko was brutal, but I like the fact that Oz uh, he um. They had him um, doing as exactly what his father did, uh, uh, and Azula actually. So that was kind of cool. I was a little worried that they were gonna start giving Zuko more developed moves than we've ever seen him pull off. So I'm glad that they didn't because that that would have really annoyed me. Or oh, and specifically, somebody mentioned like if Zuko was about to start doing uh, a lightning, I would have been fairly pissed about that because we've never seen him we could assume that he tried he yes he's redirected lightning but he's never uh conjured it himself and that would have been i thought that would have been a bit of a cop-out but uh either way i enjoyed it red red nation uh let me know what you guys think below stand up speak up and i want to see what do you how do you feel about it i really want to know i felt this one was pretty fair and i'll talk to you on the next one and eat your cabbages motherfucker Peace.